In this video, we'll cover adding a new user and setting up their phone settings. The first step is to navigate to your settings. Once there, you'll find Manage Users under User Settings. You'll then choose Add User in the top right hand corner. Fill out your user's information. You'll need their first name, last name, email, phone number, the role that they will have within your system, which decides what they have access to, as well as their department. Depending on the platform you're using, these departments may look a little bit different. Next, if you're using the OS portal, you'll decide if you want them to have access to that portal or not. Then choose Accept and Save User Details. Next, you'll want to set up their call settings. So on the left-hand side, You'll scroll down and find Manage Call Settings under Phone Settings. As long as you have usage credits on your system already, you'll be able to purchase a phone number and finish setting this up. So next, you'll choose Get Phone Number. Decide what area code you want this phone number to have and click the magnifying glass. This will populate a set of 10 numbers for you to choose from. Select the number you want and then buy number. Next, you'll want to come down here to where it says shape software phone numbers and you'll want to click choose and edit and give that phone number a name. This way you know who that number belongs to. Next, you'll scroll down to the bottom where it says user caller ID settings and you will select that number that you just purchased as the caller ID for the phone number and the SMS for this user. Next, you'll have to create an inbound call route so that if anybody calls this number, it will know where to route this phone call to. So, once again, on the left-hand side, you'll scroll down and under phone settings, you'll find inbound call routing. Once there, you'll choose add routing rules in the top right corner. You'll want to name this rule. Assign the lead source, which is inbound call, and then select the number. After that, you'll choose submit. Then you'll have to create a call flow rule. So on the right hand side, you'll see add call flow rule. Typically, you'll want to set this up to call directly so that if this person is not logged into the system, they can still receive their phone calls. You'll choose call direct number and then enter their phone number and select the duration for the ring. and choose submit rule. 
You'll also want to be sure that if there's no answers, you have selected a voicemail that will route this phone call to the voicemail green and choose submit. If you have any questions about adding users or setting up inbound call rules or their call settings, feel free to reach out to support at setshape.com.